this lecture we'll be taking a look at API routes middleware. So the API routes that we have been discussing till now provides built-in middlewares which parse the incoming request. So if you see this REQ, that is what we are talking about. There are three types of middlewares supported by next.js. One is request.cookies, the other one is request.query and the third one is request.body. In this one, we will be taking a look at request.cookies. So the first thing that we need to do is obviously install some packages like over here we have installed cookie and SWR. The next thing after installing this is to create a cookies.js file and this is basically used for creating cookies using next.js. So here we are using this cookies.js file inside API directory cookies.js and this is where the middleware is playing its role. So we are importing this cookies from utils cookies and then the handler that we have over here this is going to set the cookie. So we are saying response.cookie next.js. So the cookie that we have set is the one we are returning over here as response. So we are saying response.cookie next.js API middleware. And then we are saying return the set cookies header so we can display it in the browser. So finally we are saying res.end. So the cookie creation is basically happening over here inside utils cookies.js. As you can see, set header, serialize name string value. So this is where we are setting the cookie and here using the handler we are returning that cookie using the next JS middleware. So finally we are saying export default cookies handler. Now in pages we have one more file called index.js. Now this index.js is actually making use of use swr to access the cookie using the api slash cookies route and then whatever data it's fetching it's showing over here. Now let's go ahead and run this. So we'll go to terminal and here we'll say npm run build. Once built we'll run npm start. You can see it's started on localhost 3000. Let's open it up in the browser now. Here you can see the response coming up and here inside cookies you will notice next.js is the name of the cookie and the value that it contains is api dash middleware and that's what we are returning as well using SWR. So that was one way of uh, making use of API routes middleware in next.js.